In today's episode of Construction Week in Focus, we will turn our attention to the UAE-based renewable energy company, Abu Dhabi Future Energy Company, also known as Mazda, and the slew of deals it has inked over the last week. These agreements were inked during the Abu Dhabi Sustainability Week or the ADSW 2020, which was held from 11th to the 18th of January at the Abu Dhabi National Exhibition Centre, also known as ADNEC. I'm Anu Puman, the Deputy Editor at Construction Week, presenting the latest details on this project. The Abu Dhabi-based renewable energy company Mazda and Egypt's renewable energy developer Infinity Energy have agreed to establish a joint venture or a JV company to develop utility-scale and distributed solar energy and wind power projects in Egypt and Africa. Infinity Energy currently operates six solar PV assets with a cumulative capacity of 235 MWP in Egypt. It has completed the development and construction of Egypt's first large-scale solar power plant, followed by another three plants in the Benban Solar Park, which is touted as the largest solar park in the world. Mazda, which is a subsidiary of Abu Dhabi's Mubadala Investment Company, also launched a Sustainable Real Estate Investment Trust, or a REIT, at the Abu Dhabi Sustainability Week, making it the UAE's first green REIT. The Real Estate Investment Trust, which will have an initial valuation between $258.7 million and $272 million, which is equivalent to between 950 million dirhams and 1 billion dirhams, will be established at the Abu Dhabi Global Market, also known as the ADGM. It will also include four commercial properties within the sustainable urban community of Mazda City in Abu Dhabi. The properties cover a net leasable area of 57,493 square meters. The private REIT will also be launched as a qualified investor fund which is open to market counterparties and select clients by private placement. Continuing its support in developing clean energy projects around the world, Mazda will also establish a joint venture with Madrid headquartered CEPSA to build a renewable energy project in Spain and Portugal. The new Emirati Spanish joint venture CEPSA Mazda Renewables will focus on developing wind and solar photovoltaic projects in the Iberian Peninsula, with an initial target of 500 to 600 megawatts. Mazda has also entered the Australian market for the first time after acquiring a 40% stake in a utility-scale waste-to-energy facility. Announced at the Abu Dhabi Sustainability Week 2020, the investment will be a joint venture between Mazda and Tribe Infrastructure Group. Construction on the $352.3 million East Rockingham Resource Recovery Facility plant which is located 40 kilometers outside of Perth, Australia, has begun and is expected to take three years to complete. For more about Mazda's projects or to catch the latest developments on any other major GCC construction projects and tenders, visit our news website, constructionweekonline.com. Thank you for watching and until next time, goodbye.